Yeah, um, just the, the fact that I was able to um, like have my feet wet, you know, get my feet settled, uh, like mentally be uh, like clear, you know, e emotionally be kind of free and at peace is like with, with, with my decision and have opportunity to uh, like plan, you know, proper plan uh, of, uh, about this situation. Uh, being able to kind of draw out and have those goals and see that picture and vision, you know, what this could look like, what this could be. Whereas before it was, everything for me felt like it was rushed. Uh, it happened at the, the 25th hour. Like it was just, I didn't have an opportunity to uh, like go into the situation and, and, and really have a, a a, a great understanding of what was needed for me and, and what I needed to do. And uh, so I was learning on the fly almost. Whereas now this, you know, I had an opportunity to go to the Bahamas and be with the team and also for the team to see <clears throat> where, where I'm at, you know, physically, mentally, uh, play with the guy, you know, play on the court with the guys, play pickup, work out, and for everybody to see my mentality and, and where I'm at right now. and, and uh, like my focus level when it, when it comes to playing basketball and, and, and working and trying to win a championship is at, is at a, a high level right now. What made you want to have a decision? It wasn't forced. Like it was, it was a natural fit for everybody. And we was able to go down there, enjoy ourselves, have fun. Um, we, we, we trained together. We played, you know, we played pickup together. But also we, we approached it as if it was a real mini camp, right? It, guys had to really be in shape and get in shape and, you know, communicate and talk about, you know, what what, what our goals are and, and go out there and play. And, uh, but for the most part, everything off the court, like the way that guys was bonding, you know, I know it was only a couple of days, but anytime you're in a place like the bomb, it's like you almost, you have to bond, you know what I mean? Oh, no, no, you have to bond with your guys. So it was just good for everybody from, the rookies, the young guys, to the veterans to just be around, you know, one another and uh, have opportunity to prepare. How much, how much of it made that mini camp? How do you see it? It's basketball to me at, at the end of the day. I, I think knowing, coming into the situation, what that role is and what my role is and what I have to do, it makes things a lot easier. Uh, I, I'm, not, I'm not trying to figure it out on the fly. I'm not <clears throat> trying to make adjustments as as we go on, like I know what this team expects of me. I know what I expect of myself, uh, and, and and that's it. It's, it's it's basketball at the end of the day. Huh? To win a championship, uh, that's it. I mean, it's at, at at this point, that's the only thing that really really matters, uh, and and everything that happens along the way, as far as you know having the right preparation, uh, preparing yourself to go out there and, and, and uh, get ready for a, a long season. Uh, my role is to, to make sure that the guys on the team understand and know that this is a long, long season. Like this is not, you know, we're not going to win a championship in the first week of the season, right? We, we got to prepare, we got to take those steps. But also at the end of the day, we, we know what we're here for, right? I, I don't think nobody uh, is thinking anything differently than, than trying to win a championship. I know, you know, I haven't haven't had that 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 conversation yet, you know, with anybody. Uh, but like I said, everything that I've been talk, you know, talking to people and talked about to, uh, like I'm I'm very clear on, on on what my role is. Yeah, he put a lot of pressure on me. I'm not even gonna lie. He, he, yeah, he 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 called me. I was uh, I was on vacation with my family in, in South Africa, and he he's like, "Look, I'm not gonna sugarcoat anything. Like, we haven't won without you, but if we win with you, then that that makes all the difference." But it, for me, it was just more of like hearing his excitement for me being a part of this team and this organization, and you know his vision and what he want to accomplish and what he, you know, how he believed in, in me as a, as a person and as a basketball player.
You saying did I need that? <clears throat> Yeah, I, I, well, I, I do. I think I do a good job of like motivating myself and, and keeping myself positive, and from that aspect. But when you hear when you hear somebody like Tillman, you know, call you personally and tell you how excited he is, and then you know you have everybody else, you know, reach out to you, uh, you know, players and you know, coaches and, and trainers and staff, and then <clears throat> I think everybody loves that feeling. Like we we all need that feeling right we, we all need that validation of you know the, the hard work that we put in and people to see that and people to recognize that and people to want you to be a part of what they have going on and also they want to be a part of you know what, what you have going on too so at the end of the day I think we all we all need that say it again the opportunity itself and, and, and knowing uh, how close this team is to winning the championship. Uh, you know, I mean, we, we all watch. I, I've watched from afar and, and saw how close this team was last year. Uh, uh, injury here, a couple shots here, like it, we, we could be talking a different story. Uh, but at the end of the day, we can't, like, we, we can't live off of that. Like, we got to go back to work. You know what I mean? Like, we, we have to put the work back in. We have to continue, you know, what, what was created last year, but also understand that this journey is a long, long journey, and, and we we can't try to go do it in, in one day or, or, or one week. So. Yeah, y'all seem to take everything I say and make it a quote or a meme or something out here. Well, like I said last year, I didn't know like what to expect coming into the situation. If, if that conversation was had before, then I wouldn't have been saying. Maybe I'd have said, "Who me?" But uh, you, we 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 just don't know. Like it's it's, it's different when kind of you're clear in what is need to be done and, and what you have to do and, and what's needed of you. Like it's it's a big difference. I think everything is, everybody's optimistic, right? It's, we, we, we all don't know how none of this is going to play out, right? So, yeah, I'm new to this, you know what I mean? Like, at the end of the day, we all going to camp to try to figure out what works for this team in order to win the championship. So if that time come, we have that conversation, right? And my, my goal is to go on the training camp, be the best, be the best player I could be, be in the best shape I can be, and and do what I have to do to make the, to help this team get over the hump and win the championship. And, and that's 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 all it is. And all the questions of coming off the bench and like I don't even want to I don't even want to answer those questions. At the end of the day, whatever whatever I have to do to help this team win the championship, then that that's what's going to be done. And I think that's the same mindset for everybody else that's on this team. Well, just being able to be versatile and, and play different positions. I think the game now is very, very positionless. Like, I, I don't want to say this, but I'm sure there'll be times when Mike was going to throw me at the five like this year. It's like, <laughs> he's going to try to experiment with that. I'm sure he will. But we, the, the game is positionless, and you just don't know. Like, a, a point guard can play the two, three now. It's, it's, it's different. There's no traditional fours no more. There's no traditional fives anymore. It's like, all the five, all the five men and centers have to know how to shoot a three nowadays. It's like that's what they're working on. That's what the teams are telling them that they have to work on. So there's no position. So you really don't know where you're going to be at on the, on the court at any point of the game.